This is uh, video part two. Have you seen the light bulb is uh, burned? So we're gonna have to replace it. Also, the caps over here, they are loose. That's why water is getting in. So in the future, if you could replace the navigation light for something that is sealed completely on the top, it should uh, minimize the blown light bulb. You replace it and that should work. Took the replacement off, the bad one. You see it right here, all damaged, broken. And we're gonna put the new one in. I replaced the light bulb. I'm gonna turn on the switch to see uh, to make sure that uh, it's working. As you see, the light uh, is working now, so I, I could put everything back. Remember, for the future, probably replace it with something that is sealed, that it doesn't have that gap because water is gonna get it in and blow the light again. I screw the screws in place. And that should take care. Remember, make sure that this is closed because water is going to get in there. There's a gap between the green and the red light. Okay. Also, maybe try the next time. You could put some type of silicon uh, just to help out prevent uh, going into the, the water in between the two lights. Clear silicone. You can see the gap over here. So I'm gonna put some type of silicone in the future so we could prevent that from happening because the light is gonna burn again once it rains or, or you go into the high waters, okay? Just turn off the switch uh, and everything should be fine. See you on the next video.